Brand new. Surprise, surprise this week, what could be used? Every time anyone turns to Christ and believes in Jesus as his Lord and Saviour is good news. But this is in the surprise, surprise department. Who would have thought? Quite extraordinary. In the news this week is Russell Brand, the comedian, actor, presenter, activist, campaigner. He was in the news last year with accusations of rape, sexual assaults, emotional abuse, all made against him by a number of women. Lots of companies and organisations dropped him like a hot brick. He who had shone so brightly in the celebrity sphere was suddenly shunned by everyone. Well, not everyone shunned him. Russell Brand has announced in the last week that he has become a Christian. He was baptised in the River Thames with Bear Grylls and a mate called Joe standing either side of him, flanking him for his immersion. Russell Brand describes his conversion as an amazing gift. The faith he has discovered is changing his perspective on life and its meaning. Praise the Lord and thanks be to God for Bear Grylls who didn't shun him. Apparently Bear Grylls and Brand became friends through their television work and last year Brand joined Grylls on a trip across the Hebrides for the reality TV series Running Wild with Bear Grylls. Brand has now said, my life isn't about me. I've been caught up in an illusion. I've been lost completely in self. And now I must learn to untether myself from the tendrils of selfishness, egotism and self-centeredness and awaken to something greater. The Christianity I'm learning about is a precursor to a way of understanding consciousness and reality very clearly. Week one now, and it's been a beautiful week. Well, following Jesus is a beautiful way to live. He'll find pretty quickly that others will challenge his newfound faith. Indeed, mock him for turning to Christ. Not least because he turned to yoga and Buddhism and, well, I'm not sure what. So let's pray for him. Let's pray the reality of the love of Christ will grow so strong that he will hold firm in the weeks and months ahead. And let's pray for Bear Grylls and that mate Joe, that they'll walk with Russell as disciples together. And let's pray for those we would love to turn to Christ. Even the most surprising prodigal is within the reach of our Heavenly Father's love.